everyone, hey, and welcome back to yet another episode of Battle Rap Resume. I'm, you know, really going to skimp on the intro because I'm mega excited to get into this. So, you know, we've got the Patreon, we've got the email, subscribe to us, iTunes. Um, Shocks, I'm going to start with you. Has Jem ever lost a battle? Uh, no. No, he hasn't. Not, not in my eyes, not yet. Not yet. <laughs> Are you confident you can change that? Yeah, I'm going to beat him, 100%. Right, right, right. I mean, Jem, your record's impeccable. Can you see Shocks actually beating you? I mean, like you said, he's gonna win. Champ, <laughs> bro. Mm, mm. But I mean, like, okay, so you know, he is the champ. But I mean, he he has he's lost in the past. Shocks has lost, hasn't he? Yeah, like five times. <laughs> is it five? Is it five? Let's let's work it out. Is it five? Um, what are your two? clear wins? What are your clear wins? Um. Oh yeah, Every, that's what, oh. everybody, uh, everybody, but yeah, whatever, man. Listen, you ain't battled nobody <laughs> like me. You ain't battled nobody like me. That's that's it. What's Simple like as that. You? Well, it is like you. Right, listen. When you battle people, you battle people that are either really good with a pen, but let themselves down with a performance on the day, exactly. or you battle people that are all performance and no substance. And with me, you're gonna get the same level of writing that you're going into it with. But the aggression I bring forth, you can't handle that, bro. You know that. Come on. All right, man. You're different, bro. <laughs> you're mad different. Yeah, what? Because you're, 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 you're the hardest. You're you're the hardest person to beat, fam. Yeah, is is, is, that, is this what it is, bro? You on the daylight flex? Are you just gonna go all calm and quiet and agree <laughs> no, agree bro. with everything I say? You're the king, innit? You're tired. You're tired, innit? From gargling all that broken glass and nails to get your voice like it is before the interview. <laughs> Like, we know what it is, really, man. It's like just a four foot little dude out here. He, he speaks like fucking Mickey Mouse. He has to like gargle okay, glass to make his voice deep. Me, like, you can't do the height jokes. You're like an inch taller than me, bro. bro I'm six foot on the dot. Are you mad? You know, bro, I've got a face off of us two, bro. You're definitely not six foot. You're six no, foot. Well, bro, I was hunched down. I was hunched down. <laughs> I, was tr- I was trying to meet your eyes. It hurt my back for weeks. Down, standing up. How does that even make sense? How do you stand up and hunch? Well, I, was, I was bent over, innit? Like, I was trying to, you know, bent trying to. Over. Stand- over I mean, face offs, that's a bit strange, guys. But bro, why does your internet keep breaking up, man? Stop spending money on double denim and segways and buy some good fucking ball band, isn't it? <laughs> bro, stop spending your money on hats, bro. You bro, got I've a got... hat collection. You got a hat for every day. One in a bath. You're the type of. You're like, sh- bro. You Tox and Raptor should join a group just called Hats. Right, you no, no, listen. Hat gang, bro. Let you me explain this, yeah. <laughs> Let me explain. It. I don't wear. I don't wear thing. hats. Every minute of my life, yeah. What I do is I wear hats when I battle, and when I'm out in the street and fans stop me, I don't let them take pictures, innit? That's all it is. <laughs> yeah, because you man's heads are weird, bro. It's something that's that's why they brought me for don't flop just to battle people who don't take their hat off. Yeah, that's standard though, innit? But bro, you ain't you, you ain't had a hard life like that. You don't understand, you know? Yeah, I have, I have hair. It's hard that I'm in my thirties. I've got three kids. They keep making me battle kids. It's mad, bro. <laughs> that's cool, bro. I'm in my twenties, bro. So you. You should win. You got. You got. Because of me, you're the vet out here, cuz. I'm not a vet, man. I'm not. Yeah, a vet. I was joking. I saw we've been in this shit about the same time. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You come in like a couple months after me. Still took you a while to like catch up. But well, you're here now. Took me a while to catch up. You know. It did take you a while to catch up. Bro, listen, listen. I mean, you're gonna tell everyone that you could have been champ, but you turned it down. But no, I don't need to. I already said that. No, I never said were... I turned out. I never said I could have been the champ. I don't know if I beat so. That's a that's a different that's a different argument. But oh, yeah, no, no. you wouldn't have got the title shot if they offered it to me. No, you wouldn't. I don't need to say that. I said that to Raptor. That's like that's revisiting. I ain't gonna recycle an angle when you don't we? <laughs> I you're would have gonna, seen the title shot regardless. Say, I know what you're gonna say, but you're gonna do the whole you're gonna just talk the same you're just gonna do shocks. You got metal in it, you wear grills, so you should you used to be Having the metal in your mouth, I know you, bro. But that's that's We're fucking jeans, funny. So it's gonna be holes in your material. Like I know, yeah, it's cool, man. No, I'm not. I'm not gonna. Do, I'm not gonna go down that path. Bro. Or I'm not right. a tax battler, bro. What the fuck? <laughs> listen, listen. At the end Hold of the on. day, I'm I'm gonna talk about your jeans, bro, because you need to be like, you know, I'm I'm a man who has no fashion sense at whatsoever. I know, I and know. I can tell you <laughs> that you dress like a fucking female, bro. <laughs> no, bro. I'm cool, bro. I've never taken fashion advice from you in my life. 
No, well, obviously, but obviously. You and Tox with his fire trap trainers and you. Oh, you've been just... taking it from, from other people, though, innit? You've been taking it. Who's dialects bridging that you hit up for the fucking belt look? The belt hook. That was a lie. That was a fucking joke. Yeah, yeah, no. I don't get the joke, but that was a lie. And he was talking about Peace Soldier. So go ask Peace Soldier if I've ever hit him up. And I swear Tox was, was airing you out for a blue ink coat the other day. I don't know, innit? But yeah, he was actually, yeah, but it's not blue ink. I don't know where he really got that from. But he went at that event. Actually, was he? He was on the undercard still. <laughs> he was on the undercard. Oh, you're deep. Yeah. Gem, I mean, Shox kind of makes a point, really. Like, is Shox going to be the toughest? Yeah, no points. <laughs> well, I mean, for the, you know, are Shox the toughest guy you're going to face so far? Um, no. What, what was Ace Boogie harder or? Cool. Look, yeah. Tom's Look, yeah. getting his fucking vest on today, <laughs> mate. Wait. No, no, no. I mean, Jen, I'm just... Up to no oh, events, you want to play that? Bro, he's battled some nobodies. Don't play this on me. He's battled, bruv. He had a close battle with Johnny Storm. I wouldn't <laughs> even... Storm, bruv. You battled a nigga Coma. I don't even bro, know who bro, he is. Bro, listen. How do you get Storm one close? That Johnny Storm one close. How do you get international that nobody knows? How do you get in <laughs> someone that no one knows? How are you, you putting on an American... I'll tell you, yeah, I've got integrity. So I turned down a battle with Unanimous okay, at that cool. same event so I could battle Coma because I promised Coma that I would give him a step up if the opportunity arose, and it did. That's what Why? I did. Who is he? Who is he to you? Is he your boy? Yeah, he's just a pal. Like, listen, this is pal. what I'm saying. You've got America. A... How have you no, got no. in America? Brother, are you, are, you, are you caking? Are you paying your rent with battling? No. Then why I are you so concerned with who the opponent is? Just take the battle, <laughs> innit? If you're a sick battler, battle battle whoever they give you. It don't matter what the name is. Take the name, do the battle. Oh, no, but you're trying to jump on me on the ace boogie laughter. So let's, let's talk about your battles. That's no, what I was bro, bro, you listen, I started off by saying you've not lost a battle, innit? You've not lost a battle to anybody. Right. Like, you've, not, you've not battled anybody that's going to come at you the way that I will. And you and talking about reusing angles and whatever, go back and watch my battles, bro. I make a, a habit. My my thing is, I force myself to not go in on the same angles that everybody else does, and I'll I, be doing the I, same with you. I'll be, I'll be, I'll be. In, there's not many good. There's not many good angles that me, so I wouldn't expect you to because no one's used a good angle against me. Give me one good angle. I got that WhatsApp screenshot from the other day when you was all texting me scared. I'm and that, that on a fucking app, bro. Nah, mate. I don't talk about. No, you do, bro. Oh, bro, I got the screenshots. You tell him, man, that you dickhead. It's one hundred percent real. Oh, yeah, they were voice notes. I mean, no, they don't exist. What are you talking yeah, about? Yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go. Man can't screenshot a voice note. Fuck you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and uh, I mean, this is going to be, uh, you know, next in line, like a small Stop room. Whack, man. Like, you are, you are, you are gassing him. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I, I, Gem, you got to be excited to battle shocks, though. Like, he's a crazy battler, right? Oh my god, I've got. You you lot are high. You lot are fucking smoking crack. I've got to be excited to battle him. I mean, cool. Like, he wants to battle. We're going to battle. Like, it's cool. I said we'll battle. We'll battle. Like, it will be fun, <laughs> isn't it? Yeah, he's so, he tries to play it so cool. I'm in a calm mood. Bro, listen, I know you. I know, I know, bro, I know you. You're going to do all this like, yeah, man, I'll leave it till a week before the event to start writing and then it'll just be calm. And it ain't none of that. Bro. I bet oh, you got three rounds that. already. Dressing up every day, putting the spotlights on in the front room, shouting at the mirror. You know, oh yeah, you can definitely guarantee I'll look better. You'll be in a black hat and a black t-shirt. Yeah, because you wear black to a funeral, bro, and they're getting buried. What the fuck? Mm. Yeah, you said that. That's a not a good bar. That's terrible. That sounds trash. That sounds right, look, I don't want to upset you, man, but this that's not a bar. That's a sentence. Right, no, when you, no, you do know that when you talk to people, that's it's not right. Said, but if I say that, it's like I went black to a funeral. It's like, all right, cool, man. We're, we're just talking now, bro. You're just trying to get bars in a conversation. Like. No bars in a conversation. But if I was barring, I'd bar, innit? I told you that shit bar earlier. Don't make me drop it now. Um, yeah, that no, bar wasn't. Cool. That's why I took it out, bro. What the fuck? <laughs> I ain't got no concrete bars, but I've got, I've got stuff for you, fam. I got stuck. Bro, turn your phone off. Silent, man. What the fuck? Oh, uh, yeah. My bad. My bad. See how professional these guys are, Tom. You can't get yeah, it. Yeah. It's, all, it's all good. It's all good. It's a, it's a ple- pleasure to have both of you on. And, like, I mean, Shocks, are you Don't, excited? Wait, wait, wait. Yeah. wait, wait. You asked me, who who Shocks is hardest competition? Uh, well, I mean, Soul was uh, Tony. Come on. All uh, right. So, so there is hardest competition. Uh, now go ahead and tell me that they didn't try I never said that. Exactly. I could, right, I could, I could open an argument if you really want, but I can't bother, didn't it? 
That's like that's that's bro, neither here nor there. Put it this way. Put it this way. Go into the go into the comments on the Johnny Storm battle. Everyone's saying it's Johnny Storm's best performance in fucking ages. Koji come with his best performance oh, for me. Yeah. Crap. All the, all the people that battle me tell me before and after the battle they are bringing their best shit for me. What does that say about me? That people want to beat you. I don't know. Oh god, he's taking it literal. People write the best stuff for you. Who cares? Like I don't mean nothing. Uh, the point is, bro, don't sleep. That wasn't Tony's best shit. That wasn't Soul's best shit. Obviously. It wasn't. That's not me being deep. I'll tell you if it was. I ain't got no I ain't got no reason to lie. I don't care like that. But that wasn't like you can't say everyone writes the best for you. Not everyone writes the best for you. Bro, Soul's first round against me was one of the best rounds ever spat in battle rap, period. I mean, if you think so, I can't argue with you. I don't, I, I don't think I'm alone in thinking that, to be honest. All right, well, cool. I didn't think it was one of the best rounds in battle rap. Like, that's a big statement. Like, I could name five rounds now I prefer. Like, and that's not me boy and soul. I think your shit for Raptor and C Major was better than you. That's wow. my opinion. That's not a bad thing. You still fire, innit? I just think your shit for Raptor and for C Major was better. And I think most people might agree with that when they interject here with your opinion, cuz. Come on, Tom. Tell me <laughs> shit. <laughs> I'm Tom. What do you prefer, Soul vs C Major, his bars, and Soul vs Raptor, or Soul vs Shocks? Your opinion, go. Just say yes or no. You don't need to, like, dive and... It's got uh, to be C Major, isn't it? Yeah, I, 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 Gem, I agree with you. Yeah, I think I think he was better versus C Major and better versus Raptor, but, I mean... Yeah, and that's not a bad thing. We're still no. fighter, isn't it? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was all good. I mean, but what's your opinions on the title match, Gem? Did Soul win, or...? Um, I watched it... Like, a few weeks ago, I only see it once, though. Um, I gave it to Shocks on the first watch. I gave Soul the first, and I gave him the second, too. Mm. But I only watched it once, as I said. And I just remember Shocks winning more of them rounds, didn't it? Yeah. I feel like if he wanted to argue the first, the first is, like, I gave it to Soul, but you can still, I think, argue Shocks took it if you wanted to. So if he wants to say he free owed him, he probably can. If he no, 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 bro. I gave Soul the first. I gave Soul the first. It's 2-1. All right. Well, there we go, innit? But the whole point oh. is to make a classic battle. It's not to go in there and just make a one-sided I mean, battle. It's got no replay value. I mean, that's my whole career, though. So that's kind of my thing, innit? I don't really mm. care about class. Well, you don't think anybody's even stood up to you? No, but no, I've not said that. But I've, how many classics do I have in my whole repertoire? I've got like one. I've got one with Raptor, and that wasn't the, my closest battle. My closest battle is either Tally. I think Tally's my closest battle. Mm. I don't think the rest have been. You, people people can't argue if their opinion is, oh, yeah. If they think, oh, yeah, yeah, Big T, cool. You think that. If you think Tally, you think that. If you think Clips, you think that. But the rest. That's what I'm saying. You're going back into, like, when you talk about my battles, though, you go back into old battles. But like we're talking my, about the current form. But think about it, Tally. Tally, my don. But where is Tally on a list of battlers right now? But he gave you your closest shave, bro. Hundred percent. Yeah. I mean, if the footage came out the way that it was recorded, you might have lost it. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> oh, shit. Don't know because I won the third and the first anyway. Yeah. Well, I, I don't know. Man. The first, the first. I don't know, bro. You, you, you spat oh, twenty man. bars about you know different parts of a car and that. I don't really understand what I had to do with Tally, but yeah, no, it's fire. It was fire. You're going to talk to me about scheming? Oh my God, please. You still <laughs> hey, I, scheme, I scheme to a punch. That's all. You scheme, scheme is a way to get to a punch. Damn. You, you scheme, scheme for scheming. And you scheme after the punch. You'll like say one word that's like, right. it'll be like the way you start a next bar. You'll be like, I've got hair gel. And then you'll say something like, we're I'm over hair, like to start your next <laughs> bar, some next shit. Like. Now you're reaching, bro. You're reaching. Oh, you reach. No, oh, bro, you're reaching. Man's, oh, man's oh, fully on that... some dot shit today. You, like, what's that about? talk no. about what I did in a battle three years ago. Oh, but I ain't lost a round. That's what you're doing. 2004. You're doing, bro. You ain't lost a round. Didn't Since you just say you got the first and the third? Yeah. What, what are you talking about? When did you battle Tally? 2014. Ah, uh, fuck you then. <laughs> <laughs> like, you were going back years. Like, still wear denim on denim now, innit? So whatever. No, I don't. I don't own no denim on denim. It's blessed. I got suede. You got nothing in your wardrobe. You got nothing I would wear in your wardrobe. I don't even I don't even want to see what your wardrobe's full of bare reebok and kappa. Like allow me in it. <laughs> no, not even, bro. Well not even. you live in sports direct. Don't no. don't don't no. No, no behave bro. behave with your sports direct self. Bro, listen, the only brand name shit I buy is footwear and yeah, t shirt. Like t shirts. That's Where, it. I don't care about friend. fashion. Why care yeah, about fashion? Well, you're talking to me about fashion. Don't. You don't care about fashion, so don't talk about it. 
Man's gonna spend nine one. bills on an outfit to go and stand on a corner shot in work. Like, what's the what? I don't stand <laughs> on the corner for a working boy. It's metaphorical. You know what I'm saying? Corner. What I'm saying is, it's like it's it's pointless. I'd rather spend the money on my kids and shit that actually matters. Yeah, it's cool. I'm a look short. I look after everyone in my life, bro. I'm good. I'm straight. Uh, no, I don't believe around. that. No, nah, that's cool. You I, don't. I don't believe to. you're straight, but it's it's minor. It's minor. I know. I know you're straight financially, but it's cool, man. It's cool, bro. Go go clap off some cigs and some cans, cuz. Oh, bro, cans. I've never said can. Don't do that to me. <laughs> Are you yeah, mad? Bro. Are you mad? I've never you called have. a gun a can. Oh my have. god. It's been researching you, fam. Bro, I've, I've never called a gun a can. You're a sick, so. you're a sick can type of guy, innit? It's cool. No, go, no, go. I did one one bar that mentioned the sig, and I don't know if you know, bro, but six hour is a make it's of a, gun. It's yes, a very good make of gun, no, very reliable. No. I know it is. It's a brand. It's not even a type of gun. It's a brand of gun. Yes, I yeah. know this. And they're American guns. It's not made in America, bro. Right. Do your research. Well. Do your research. <laughs> anyway, let's get off the gun talk. We didn't. Yeah, yeah. And, um, I mean, we spoke about, uh, you know, Shocks and Soul. Um, Shocks, did you see Gem versus Raptor, the most recent one? I did, yeah. I did. It was it was amazing. I mean, look, this, bro, I'm not going to, I'm never going to sit here and say that Gem shit. Like, I'm one, right. like he's, he's one of my favourite battlers. He's amazing. He's an amazing battler. Mm. But, he has to take a loss at some point, and I'm determined to make sure it's me. I watched him versus Raptor. I thought it was amazing. Don't lose, bruv. Gonna on fucking the flip, lose. On, the, on the flip side, on the flip side, Raptor, that's my don. So he knows I will be as honest as as, as I can, mm. and it ain't gonna offend him. Raptor was not a hundred percent in that yeah. battle. The battle was more one sided than the first one, and you know, it, I mean, it obviously helped that Gem had a twelve minute first round or whatever. But you know, it's, it's cool, man. It's cool. Maybe he thought it was a one rounder and tacked two rounds onto the end or something. I don't know. <laughs> cool, I can rap for that long and no one get less. Mm. Yeah, that is true. Man. You're supposed to edit, bro. You know what editing is, isn't it? Yeah, well, when your battle gets pushed back twice, I don't give a fuck. Bro, you know, that doesn't mean you turn up with six rounds worth of material. You understand? You well, just, no, my, if you keep writing, you edit it down. My That's round it. was. Oh, your um, round was five minutes, but you got so much reaction that you had, they had to what hide a venue for another day and whatever to keep the battle going. <laughs> no, the round on, on camera is eight minutes. So you know what? If you're gonna have punchlines, like at least makes sense. Like my round was eight minutes on cap, so for me pulling it back, yeah, and crowd reaction, that sounds about right. So eight minutes, bro, pulling it back. I never got. Well. Oh yeah, you do that, innit? You do all that pulling it back shit on the oh, Tay Rock yeah. flex. Tay Rock flex again. Yeah, because they cut me up, in it? Depends what bars it. So, yeah, I brought it back. They're fucking up my whole shit. Start the whole thing again. Yeah. Run it back 16 bars. They stopped me on every bar. Yeah, don't do that when we battle, innit? Tell the crowd to shove them, innit? If the crowd don't, wanna, if the crowd don't want me to bring it back, then tell them not react, innit? We'll tell them just react for your shit. It's cool. I'll beat you in the silence. I, <laughs> I, ain't, tell them. I ain't got to tell them, bro. That'll be how it is, innit? By, the, by about the second round, they're going to they're gonna be dying off cheering for you anyway. Cool, fine. I was there last year, innit? I did okay. I was you there. did, bro. It was sick. It was sick. Mm. To be fair, it was sick. You had the whole crowd hanging on your every word, especially that sort of two, three minute bit in the middle where you didn't say a word. That was amazing. <laughs> they was all hanging yeah. on that like it was crazy. The, the the look on their faces in the crowd, like you know, waiting with bated breath for you to just actually That's the say something. Though. You choke, that you'll was lose that round. That's the difference. If you you choke, you'll lose a round. I won't. That's the difference. <laughs> That's a one round battle. I choked it and I won clearly. So yeah, I don't bro. really give a fuck. I was ill. I threw up before the battle. Man, see me. You saw me. You were there. What am I on about? You see me throw up. <laughs> you was throwing up in the alleyway. Uh, oh, yeah, man. you know I threw up. So I knew something was going to go wrong that day. So I don't really care. I was happy I got what I got out. And I missed out another two minutes of bars I had for man. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, that's crazy. I jumped to something. Well, jump forward too far. I just jumped to the first bit I remembered. And then I had to switch up the whole order. It got fucked from there. I was just drawing random shit. Do you know what I reckon? I reckon you was in the swing of it. And then you turned to the right. And where that little bell was next to the bar, you caught reflection of yourself and realised you were just like Justin Bieber and it fucked your whole game up. <laughs> That's what I reckon. I was wearing a wine up. Bro. I don't care. You look the same every time I see you. You have one outfit. Your wardrobe is like a fucking Simpsons wardrobe. No, but them purple... Wait, bro, <laughs> listen, them purple hang- boots are fire, bro. Let me tell you that. I don't own no purple boots. I don't lie. No, I got Tim's. I got some burgundy Tim's there. Tim's. There you go. I wear Tim's. Your boots are cat. What's that cat make? You got cat boots. You wear cat boots. Don't even talk to me. You I wear, wear the big Tim's. Ones I wear Tim's. I don't own Tim's. That's oh, all I wear. 
It's Teams brand. like Air Force Ones. That's my only footwear. You wear Primark pimp soles. Them no, two I mean. pound ones that man them at festivals have. No, I don't do that. Footwear's got to be expensive, and it? it's got to feel nice. Yeah, you gotta push that thirty pound budget. Right. So, hey, let's not talk about budgets, bro. We, can, you know, <laughs> let's let's not do that. All right, all right. And uh, just finally on on the battle, what is the agreed like? Is it going to be three minute rounds or what? No, we've been told. Well, I, don't, I mean, personally, we've been told as far as I know, three rounds unlimited. Wow. Um, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not going to turn up with fifteen minutes of material. I'm not. I'm not stupid, but I'm sure he will. I mean, hey. I ain't really. I never set myself a time limit because no one really sets one with me. But I just write to when I'm, I'm done. So, so same way I wrote for die, you know, it's all the same shit. It just is what it is. But no, nah, I ain't coming. I'll write that three minutes. I'm good. Three, four. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Right, and you're gonna do though. I think it's joke. Like you're gonna lose. Yeah. Yeah. You just want to be that guy that's like, I don't want a title, but I beat the champ. Well, no, nah, you wanted to battle. The battle got booked, didn't it? Like, it's just all, it is what it is. They booked the battle. I said what I want. They gave me what I want. It was that like, weren't nothing, nothing personal. But everyone thinks you got. But you, you got a lot of people thinking you're gonna win. It's just, it's just funny, isn't it? Like, well, you got to prove. I don't know. Tom thinks is gonna win. Come, Tom. You can be, you can be unbiased, isn't it? Because I don't really care. Like your opinion's your opinion. You're allowed an opinion. Oh man. Oh, Matt, you really put me on the spot right now. Um, no, he hasn't. Just tell him. Tell him you think I'm going to win. And I know you think I'm going to win. So just tell him that. I just... I don't know. Jem, I've never seen you challenge is the problem. And I've seen shocks under real pressure. And I've I, I, Not to say I don't love your writing, but that's the only reason. I'd maybe waver towards shocks a little bit, but only a tiny hair. But do you know what's funny? A year ago, the same things asked, you got asked. You said me. Hmm. So it's just, you're just going off what you've seen lately. And no, what, yeah, that's because look, look at the growth across. in the last year, bro. Look at my growth in the last year. You've had one battle. <laughs> what are you on about? <laughs> no, I've you not had, had one battle, battle in the last year. Jesus Christ. You've had this one guy. battle in the last year. You battled Soul. That's it. No, bro. I battled Tony in October. That wasn't this year, bro. That was in 2006. No, I said in the last year, as in a 12 month period. Oh. Who cares? <laughs> Jeez. Yeah, you battled Tony. Yeah, you, you, you did good against Tony on Soul. That's cool. I'm not either of them, though. Cool. I fuck with Tony. Tony, my G. Who have you battled that's like me? Name me one person you battled like me. You can't. No, no one. Exactly. So this whole, I've never battled no one like you. You've never battled no one like me. Ever. Uh, what I'm saying is, I've gone against people that are better writers. Better writers. But I've never had to battle it's somebody right, that writes like you, but it's on the same street flex that I'm on. Because I can really get comfortable with that. Writing is not everything in battle rap, though. No, I know that, bro. you got to perform it as well. But you'll yeah, do yeah. that, innit? You'll do that. You'll do the Barry White thing and, do you know what I mean? Well, I'll go on family, you want action White's and all thing. that. <laughs> What's the what Barry mean? White thing? The voice, bro. Come on. The voice? Bro, you stole Jace's whole shit. Don't try it. <laughs> But I don't you know, know bro, but against against Soul, you were sounding the Jonai was coming out of you, so I don't know why you're talking to me about that. Like, bro, listen. Waste, you, bro, listen. You, rip, you have ripped off Jace from day, day like, one. We're talking about Jace. Like, my voice is my voice. Like My voice is naturally however the fuck you think it is. Like, but it is what it is, man. You're still going to lose. Like, it'll be a good battle, but you won't win. No, I'm just not having it, bro. I'm not, I'm not, listen, I'm not having some guy stand there Getting in my face about what well, one fam, do you want action with the line shaped into the eyebrows and all I ain't buying it, bro. Right, I ain't man. buying it. I'm not buying nothing from someone who looks like a Morrison butcher cause like I do not <laughs> care cause come to the battle. That's why you wear a hat because you're not used to it. It's like when you take your hair off, you gotta put a hat on. So Let like, me tell you this, that was the best yeah. bar you could have ever done and you wasted it on a Twitter banter, bro. Like oh, cool man. That's cool. it. But I own that shit. And what? I'm the, I'm the world's most swagged out Morrison's Butcher. What? <laughs> no, you're not. That's the worst thing. Those yeah, Morrison's Butchers that'll put you to shame. Your swag's horrible. <laughs> nah, I never. Swag's horrible. We dress. Bro, bro, like go shame, man. man. Don't look bummy in my battle. What do you mean, don't fresh, look bummy? Get a fresh trim, but I can't even say that to you. Get a satin. I don't know. Bro, listen, I'm going to jump on the website after this and I'm going to do the whole battle head. dress. Why yeah. NLC, innit? I'm going to do the whole battle in my NLC clothes. And then let you diss my outfit when I'm sitting there. polish. Shoe polish for your head. I want that shoe. shit looking shiny. 
shoe polish for my head. You know, shoe polish is black and, and brown and whatever, yeah? Like, <laughs> don't you just mean like some beeswax or something if you want it to be nice and shiny? There we go. Get beeswax for your head. <laughs> Mind your beeswax. Listen, just <laughs> stop. Okay, okay, look. You know what? I'll, I'll do the battle bald. I'll do the battle without a just to fuck you off. <laughs> hey, Tom. Hey, Tom. Tom. Yeah. Imagine Shock's putting hair gel in, on his head, just leaving it there. He just have this big patch of green shit right. just on his head. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, I don't even understand why this is a thing. Like, I lost my hair and it is what it is. Like, who needs hair? I shaved that shit. I've been shaving that shit for like 20 years. Even when I had hair, I was shaving it. So don't, I don't look no different than I did 20 years ago, apart from being fat and old. Well, uh, look, that's we... all the bars I'm gonna have, bro. I've got three rounds <laughs> on your head and the way you dress. That's it, bro. Listen, I'm gonna do the whole battle and wine on sea clothing, and my whole first round is just talking about my baldness. I'm gonna defuse your whole shit. <laughs> all right, cool. I've got a whole round about letting off the bald heads, isn't it? Watch. It, what's a bald head? So you know, it comes out the can, doesn't it? Oh God, kill <laughs> me. Dickhead. This is what I can expect from you, innit? The can. Oh, yeah, bro. The can? The can singing and shit when like I, this. When I open the can, yeah, the spray the can gonna get you off. wet. Yeah, bro. It's not, it's kinda, why not? We <laughs> but, can do this. <laughs> um, look, okay. We, we, you know, we discussed this battle. You what now? Bro, we can't hear you on your talk talk broadband. Sort, sort that shit out. <laughs> look, well, uh, you know, we, we've spoken about this battle at length. Let, let's go through this card quickly. Do, do you guys want to touch on the tryouts at all, or do you want to just get to the main card? You got to tell I, me who the fuck they are. I don't, I don't mind, like, you know, talking about tryouts. Obviously, Gem don't want to discuss the little people or whatever. I don't know who but, they are. You've know, got to tell me who they are. Yeah. I don't know them. Yeah, well, I mean, like, I, no, it's fair enough. I'm not even saying it like that. I appreciate you, Mike. How would I? Like... They're tryouts. How would I know them? They're trying out. Exactly. Well, yeah, I mean, they're kind of like, uh, you know, some dub scandal guys. So we have Mr. Quinny, first of all, who none of us know, because I think he comes from, like, Danny Jack was saying he comes from, like, you know, the entry at Dome Flop kind of thing, versus LS Dean. I mean, shocks. Good to see LS Dean on the card, I guess. It is. It is. I mean, doing another tryout thing, though, is like, it feels like a bit of a part to him, to be honest. But Yeah. But it's but, a you know, crazy card to be part L- of. LSD. Yeah, yeah, like it's just good for him to get on it. But I think LSD is an amazing, an amazing writer. I just think he lets himself down with the nerves more than anything. But he's got some incredible writing. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, no, I, I agree, I agree, definitely. And um, uh, Terminal versus Deviant as well. Terminal Adam, you know, I know is a good, good friend of the show. As I always fucking say, I know. But um, Gem, uh, like, are you aware of these guys at all? I guess, I guess you're not really familiar. Nah, that's why I'm just saying nothing right now. <laughs> but, uh, Gem, I know that you know who Domsky One is, right? Oh, yeah, I know who he is, but right? does he battle? I've never seen yeah, him battle. Yeah, 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 Dom, Dom battles a fair bit, man. He's he's pretty interesting, actually. He's doing some good shit. Who does he battle on? Um, he battles Dub, Dub Scandal. Dub Scandal, yeah. I've never actually seen that league, you know, like the battles. I see, like, Bro, the Facebook group and that. They're amazing. Mm. They're so entertaining. You know, like, it's just the videos. I never come across, like, anything I've been on. I've never seen, like, anything pop up, like... Yeah, but I check said it out. to them. Someone send me some, some shit, innit? Yeah, man. Dom's blessed. Mm-hmm. That terminal yeah. sick as well. Yeah, he's the, he's Tom Terminal's uh, the guy that's the long hair, innit? Irish guy looks like Soul. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly. Yeah, very yeah, yeah. just kind of like cultural reference heavy, kind of a bit counterculture. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah, yeah. No, terminal sick yeah. as well. Yeah, no, that's like going to be good. Um, and Conman Curve Man uh, battling Manic. I mean, Scoop wants to battle <laughs> Conman Curve, which is crazy. Yeah. <laughs> What's man's name? Conman Curve. Conman Curve, yeah. Hey, that is a bossy name. <laughs> man's Conman Curve. I rate that. That's bossy. <laughs> shout, shout, shout out Conner, he's a good dude, yeah, but, um, I mean, yeah. That's alliteration. Yeah. <laughs> Conman Curve, jeez. CC, no email attachment, man. That is that is just who he is, yeah. But, Bars, bro. Yeah, Bars. Yeah, yeah. Bars. Uh, and then I guess last on the we get Milky uh, Milky Bucket versus Sherpa. I mean Sherpa was meant to battle the last next in line, so it's good to see him on this one. No, no, the amount of bars he's had set up, uh, battles he's had set up on that, and then he still drops on the day. Like he's, I feel sorry for the guy. I, I've tried to get him in about four different events, and they'll they'll book it, and then the brother, fucking battle drops out. He's the mm. older brother, isn't he? Yeah, yeah, man. Yeah, 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 no, it's and uh, Jim, we get to sort of the main events now. So good to see Matrix finally battle him, right? Yeah. My G. This is this is what I'm most excited about for the whole event. Wow. Yeah. Especially because he's battling Maverick. He's mm. fucking amazing. Like he's making right. making a wave right now. I ain't seen Maverick in it, but uh, he's I fire. Got, he's fire. I got mates. Mm. I got mates. 
And I mean, like, oh yeah, bro, listen, bro, Ma- Maverick's fire, but I've got Matrix purely because Matrix sends me bars sometimes just on a random one. But I listen to him, and afterwards I just don't want to rap for a little Matrix week. Is one of the, <laughs> yeah, standard. Matrix standard. is one of the best rappers. He's top five rappers I know. Not even battle rappers. He's just rappers. He's one of the best rappers. He He's incredible. He's incredible. Jesus Christ. I mean, for you two guys to be fucking saying this as well, like, yeah, they are, cannot cannot wait for this. And um, we get also, of course, this is a sort of training days kind of event. We get the training days title match shocks. JB versus Lazy Ass Jack. How do you see this one? I've got JB personally. I hey, fam, I'm hyped for this battle. No yeah, because yeah, this is like midgets versus giants. Cause I, I want to see how they're gonna film this shit. Yeah. I want to hear tall and short bars. I'm rooting for JB because I hate tall niggas. Yeah, but this <laughs> fire. I don't even want. I don't want them to have bars. I'm not listening for bars. I want reasons why tall people are shit and reasons why small people are shit, and then we'll see who's the real winner at the end of the day. That's the fight everyone wants to see. That's mm. a great hype. It's a hype battle. I like that. That's really, is that really it? Ewok versus Groot? Yeah, that's like that. I want to hear short jokes and tall jokes. That's it. Now, do you know what? I think I rate Lazy Ass Jack. I think he's sick and mm. he's on a real come up. But I think JB, um, on the first next in line, actually, no, I don't know if a lot of people know, but on the first next in line, like one of my requirements to take the battle with Tony for Danny was that he got the JB battle with Jay Shoot on the card. Mm. Because I'd never seen him live and I think he, like, he's got a wicked pen. Mm. So yeah, I think I think Lazy Ass Jack's good, but I do see JB taking that. And why? Just his his overall pen, like the way he puts things together. I don't know, but like, do you know what? I don't even like. I'm, I'm going to say this just openly, with no disrespect intended, but I'm I'm answering the question, right? Yeah. I don't see either of these guys as believable when they get into the swing of like aggressive rapping. Yeah, right? they both do that. They both have that problem, and they're well. both not they believable both when they do it. Mm, but yeah. I think the JB way the way JB yeah, yeah yeah I think the way JB writes though like there's certain parts that he can pull that off whereas I think if Lazy Ass Jack was to do the same bar with the same delivery it would look awkward right I, I don't know like, maybe, maybe that sounds stupid like but that's, no. I feel like there's not much in this battle car they both kind of rap the same way and they both do the thing where they both get too kind of they both get too hyped they both get too hyped I think JB does it like Lazy Ass Jack's more like erratic with it and it kind of comes out of nowhere. JC kind of builds it up in his voice and you can hear it coming. Like he gets like, mm. <laughs> with a, <laughs> with a, <laughs> and he yeah. keeps going. Yeah, yeah. Like, I feel like they both kind of write similar, but JB just has that bit more experience, isn't it? Yeah, He's exactly. giving you know, performances and I've seen Lazy Ass Jack stumble like a couple times, I think. Mm. So I think maybe Kate. just that experience, but there's not really yeah. much in that he writes similar for me. JB's like, he, I know JB has his problems or whatever and, and, you know, cancels battles when he needs to. But when I've seen him battle, like, it's a very clean performance. And I think that's that's going to swing it on the day. I think right in, they're going to be neck and neck. It's just literally about who gets the, the cleaner performance on the day. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yeah, no, I think I think that's fair. Um, Jem, uh, one of your early bodies was Frankie and now he's facing Bender. What do you think of this one? I've got a couple bodies of mine, actually on this card still um i'm joking i'm not but yeah um i don't really watch bender like i've never really watched bender i see him against soul that was it and soul said he pissed himself so i just want to hear more jokes about that right. oh man the maltese frankie will do on your in i can only imagine but i hope frankie i want frankie to win not on bars i want him to win on performance because he wins on bars in every battle so that don't matter in it i want him to win on performance do you know what I told him time ago? Like we had a sit down talk, and I was like, "Listen, you're you're one of the best pens in battle rap that I've seen, but you know, like you don't have the conviction behind you when you perform not, it, he doesn't and that's what's letting you down." Mm-hmm. Yeah, but to be fair, bro, since that chat, and he went off and he said to me like, "I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna do that." He come back and he, oh, hang on, he come back and he battled Jay Shaw, and he battled Crafty. Both of those performances were fucking spot on. I ain't seen the Jay uh, the Crafty thing because it ain't dropped in it. Which is a piss take because that battle was incredible. But um, straight up, nah. I just want him to dominate. I just want him to be in his zone, like mm. just just come like in a zone, just like comfortable. I want him to be comfy because like he wins, but like he don't ever look like he's in his bag, like he's in his zone. I want him to look like he's in his zone, like this be a standout performance kind of thing. Watch the crafty battle if it ever drops, then because that was his breakout performance. But he was mm. comfortable. He controlled the whole room, like. 
even there was one part you got oh, yeah, about, about, about it, it made it rhyme and made the whole crowd it. yeah made the whole crowd laugh like he's like Frank's dope but he's like I've, I've not heard a lot but he sent me some material that he's got for Bender and it's fucking crazy bro. Mm. crazy I heard they're similar though innit yeah but they got a similar style but I think I swear Bender's like Frank said Bender's one of his biggest inspirations in yeah Bender. Them yeah. niggas look alike. <laughs> this is like Frankie battling himself in ten years. This is another grudge match. So we got the height, the, the the battle of height, and now we got the battle of like future me versus like past me because they look the same. They got the same beard. Their beards look like they be entangled together, and when they like join up, it's like creates a power between them. <laughs> Holy <laughs> shit! Uh, oh, and shocks Frankie like stole man's beard that's gonna be his first <laughs> round like blood you catted my face <laughs> that's deep that's deep uh, shocks you're a bit more familiar with Bender it's really exciting to have him coming over to like a fiddler's event isn't it it's crazy but it's do you know what though it's like I don't know there's, there's certain battlers that just they get too big so that they have to constantly be on the main stage but you forget how at ease and commanding they can be in a pit environment and you don't get to see them very often and I mean I'm excited to see him in a small venue like that do you know what I mean feeding off the energy of the crowd who Bender yeah yeah Bender's great bro have you not seen uh, who was it when he battled Sid Vicious Mm, no I've only seen him a soul in it you what you've only seen him a soul in it do you know the problem with Bender bro if he take if, like if he wants to win the battle, he's Does he's he world like, He ain't battled for a while, was he? When was the last battle we had? Uh, so- <laughs> was it Saurus? Maybe I'll have to check that. Um, but he hasn't doesn't battle regular, does he at all? So oh, mm. spent, yeah, the one where he spent three rounds choking on his words outside the bridge. Yeah, that was, yeah. <laughs> that was Pete. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good. Hang on, what's his last battle? He battled Peanut on the Gully versus Gannett card. Oh, he battled Fredo as well on the bunker. So he's had a few. Oh, that yeah. was a good battle. Yeah, yeah, that was that was a good battle. Now, That's the uh, one that put me onto Fredo as well. He was crazy in that battle. Yeah, and um, oh. the you know the the battle uh, the penultimate battle underneath you guys, um, Scoop versus Yunnan. Um, I put a poll out for this battle. Uh, who do you think is going to win? Eighty percent of people went with Yunnan. Is that a fair decision, Gem? On man's history, I guess, yeah. Mm. It's fair, of course it's fair. It's Yunnan, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, it's fair, of course it's fair. It's Yunnan. Mm-hmm. Like, they're allowed to say that, if they want to say that. Like, I don't think it's that much of a landscape between them, nah. But I can see why the fans do. Fans earned that. I mean, can Scoot beat Yunnan? Yeah, of course you can. Mm-hmm. They can beat each other. Like, I, I ain't called this one. Like, I fuck with both of them. Like, I told Scoop, I was like, yeah, I feel like it'll be the only way someone's going to get bodied is if someone's on a net on, like, another level mm. or someone's underprepped. That's it. Or else if they both come how they usually come, which is they both usually come with some shit, then I feel I'll be too one either way. I don't see anyone getting free old unless someone goes above and beyond and someone don't. I, and Shocks, what is this to you, this matchup? How are you calling it? It's a hard one, man. I've I've heard material from both of them. Like, realistically, um, I fuck with them both heavy, and like I rate them both heavy. Uh, but I think they're both unique in what they bring to the table, and it's gonna be it's a star class. Yeah, Scoop is amazing at what he does, but I think that the outcome of this battle is gonna come down entirely to the prep that Yunnan does and how he decides to approach it. I think if he comes in and does the whole you know, shouting mythical dragons, warships and stabbing the pyramids, then he's going to lose, to be honest with you. But if he comes even remotely like he did against, you know, Shuffle or even Koji to an extent where he does the, 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 the aggression, but with the sarcastic breakdown of your underlying character flaws as well, I think he could very well beat Scoop. And I, and, I, and if he comes like that, I would give it 3-0 to him as well. I don't even mean that as an insult to Scoop. Mm. But yeah, I think he could. If, if, if Yunnan comes prepped the way that I think he's going to, like, I think Scoop's going to have a shot, to be honest. That was a really concise breakdown, Shocks. Thank I'm you. trying, bro. I'm trying, That's man. Good. That was a bare descriptive. <laughs> man went ham. I mean, can Scoop, yep. can, can, can if, if Yunnan, in a small room, he's in this resurgence, he's in monstrosity mode, like, can Scoop really, con- like, don't get me wrong, I'm a huge Scoop fan, like, I think Scoop's fantastic, but, like, 
I feel like the energy is going to be in Yunnan's favour. You saw Scoop at checkpoint four, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like you, so, what you got to understand about Scoop is that if you're just if you're looking at them in like volume of delivery and whatever, then obviously Yunnan is is taking that. Mm-hmm. But the thing with Scoop is that I don't think it really comes across on cam like it does in the room. Like he just has that that like you know the the uh, staccato like monotone flow when he does his bars. But he's a big guy and he's got a commanding voice. And when he spits, the whole room hangs on to his every word, bro. Like shock, sir, shock. Scoop in the building is different. Scoop in yeah, the building. He really is. He commands that shit. Like and he's he's got natural performance. Mm. Very it's still one of his biggest his biggest things. It's his performance, his delivery. It's just the way he is. So he's got the kind of it factor yeah. which works in his favour. Yeah, like, I think that's what everyone wants in it. But yeah, like he can scoop saying a bar will sound better than Yunnan saying a bar. That like, a certain bar he'll deliver it and it will hit. The way he delivers his bars, the way the flow is, it bangs. Like his bars pop off more because of the way he delivers them. He sells that shit. But I don't know that. Like, I know what you're saying with the intensity levels of Yunnan and that. But it depends who gets that first. And if Scoop has a fucking was that the little phone charger, one of them type yeah. of moments. He can yeah. he, he's back to back with it. So with you now we're gonna be waiting. His punches like this is a different type of fight. Scoop is a boxer. He's just gonna be punching man's head off. He's gonna come with his angles here and there or try a joke, but he, he's mainly a puncher. Yunan isn't I don't define Yunan as a puncher at all. He's not a puncher to me. He's just a he's a battle rapper. He does his own thing. So with him you've got to wait more. So his punches may land heavier and scoops may not. But if scoops land in heavy punches back to back, that will give him momentum and that will give him the crowd on the side and that will get the crowd hyped. Because once the crowd's in a, in like flow of reacting, if the shit keeps coming in and it's good, they're just going to stay gassed. Mm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, that's fair. That's yeah. fair. No, they, they, this is an exciting fucking matchup, really. Uh, smart, put it together matchup. Um, I was hearing some rumors actually that I think it was originally meant to be Scoop versus Big Cannon, which would have been crazy as well. It was. But, that's how it was put to me yeah. as well. Oh man, that is yeah. That that, that needs to happen I one day. Why that flopped as well? But yeah, yeah, it's a shame. Yeah, I prefer this battle anyway. Yeah, yeah, me too. And uh, finally, Gem, uh, we spoke about it. You know, ad nauseum to a certain extent. Final thoughts on you versus Shocks? You're not beating me. <laughs> <laughs> Simply put, uh, shocks uh, yourself. He's getting beat. I want to know why he can beat me. This is what I want to know. I just want to know why. Why? All right, because why? I'm gonna. What do you do? Be- All right. Firstly, firstly, there's really not like a five minute angle you're gonna pull out on me without getting personal. I'm not because... gonna have no angles. Why do I need angles to beat you? But right, then, bro, if that's what I'm saying, if it's just bars, my punch count will be higher than yours. Uh, it will be higher. I think it will be of better quality as well. I think you're going to have some amazing punchlines, but I know what I've already got on my pad right now, bro, and there is some seriously deep shit. But I, my whole point when I take battles is that pad. I have to be... I have to be... Yeah, on nothing. Lines, nothing. Lines on my nothing. Pad. Nothing mm-hmm. right now. But what I'm saying is, when I take a battle, lines. my only concern is beating my past performance, not beating the guy I'm battling particularly. That's so cool. whatever I bring to your... And what I'm planning to do pad. is give you... What I'm going to give you is three rounds of my third against Soul. That's what you're getting. Three rounds of your third. I don't, to be fair, I can't remember that, like, t- too much from that battle. I remember certain standout lines you both had. Well, you ain't going to remember much after our battle, I'm telling you. <laughs> All right, bro. You're stumbling at the door of amnesia. That's cool, man. I mean, you battle, you battle, you battle really good guys, man. Like, so I'm, I, I'm, I'll, I'm looking forward to this, man. I think you're in for a surprise. Bro, I battled Smart Alex and Cracker, bro. You don't know about hardship. <laughs> you battled Smart Alex, Cracker, yeah. Like, I don't know. It's harder. it's harder. It's harder. It's harder to... I don't know. I don't know. You've never had no one come at me like you. You've never had no one come at you like I will, ever, in your whole life. Mm, we'll see. You don't see me slap. You might see me slap, but even when I slap, I've got fire. Even when I write my bars on fucking dumb days prep, I still come with a full clip. So imagine I didn't do that. Imagine I actually didn't write my bars in fucking a week and a half. Yeah. 
So you got your rounds now. You got rounds or parts that you've been writing. If you gave, if I did the same shit, if I had your hunger, oh my god, like you see me on fifty percent, ninety percent of the time, bro. It ain't hunger. Don't listen. Don't get it twisted. This is the yeah. problem, yeah. When I say I've got material, people think I sit there and I'm writing rounds now. I don't. I don't ever sit down and go. Tonight's the night I'm gonna draft a round. I just write punches as they come to me, and they come to me constantly. So I just write them in my notes. I might write. I might write a hundred punches tomorrow, and ninety five of them don't pertain to you so they're not going to get used in my material for you but the five that do are going to be better than five you write it's as simple as that <laughs> like, i don't ever talk bro but i'm telling you now i'm beating you fam watch you're taking right. your first loss all right bro. and we you can will. do one of these afterwards and you can lick your wounds on the fun, fucking when you were just gassed like oh so, bro, this, this, this is crazy to me one one battle and everyone One's hyped like you won one battle. Yeah, you beat. What's the one battle I won? What's the one battle I won? You won one battle on a streak. You've on a streak of one. If we're talking about a winning streak, you're on a one streak, right or wrong? Right. It depends on whether you listen to judges or the general consensus, doesn't it? Well, I was in a building and I left because I felt like Tony won, and there's people that know that because I didn't wait to see the judges' decisions. So I felt like that, and I'm not biased because I waited around for other ones where I thought he it was a closer bow. So I was well, like, oh, right, I well, that's it. your opinion. That's your opinion. As far well, as I know, biased. every poll online, everyone that's been interviewed, I'm not agree biased. With I'll tell Tony to his face. I'll tell Tony, right? I think that was close. I do think it was close. I think you got the first, you got the second too. Bro, listen. All that matters is people said I was going to die against Tony. I did not. People said I could not beat Saul. And, and I did. Now and the same, the same people what? sitting there saying that I'm not going to beat you. And I'm going to. Oh, no. I think, I think that, bruv, you're meant to beat me. You're the champ. You should beat me. You're the champ, right? So yeah. you have to beat me. I will. It's not, it's not a choice. You have to beat me. You're the champ. No, no not at all. Yeah, you have to beat me. Bro, anyone can lose on the day. But I'm not going to. Anyone can lose on the day, but you have to win. You lose. What's the point of being a champ? Well... You got, Bro, you got. What's order. the point of being a champ right now? That's what everyone wants to fucking know, isn't it? Hey, I don't. Hey, I don't know. I'm not involved in all the drama. I do my. <laughs> that's, an- that's another shit. interview. Mm. <laughs> yeah, I do my side of shit. But I don't know why after one battle the fans are gassed on you. But it is what it is. If you want the title, I'll put the title up. I don't care. I don't want what you just. You just said the. Op- this isn't even don't flop. First of all, that's the no, main. This is this is even yeah. So that's a whole nother conversation. And second of all, no, I don't want to be the champ. I'm black. That's lucky. All right, all right. Well, uh, so <laughs> well, yeah, we'll, we'll wrap it up here. This has been uh, this has been enlightening. Uh, Gem, uh, <laughs> oh, always um, always got to big up uh, Wine LC Clothing. How's, how's it going with the line at the moment? Yeah, no, it's always doing good, man. Um, yeah, it's always doing good. I'll have everything there at training days. I forgot the name of the event for a second. Next in line. Jesus, that's how you know I'm working this. Yeah, um, I have everything there at next in line in it. So if you want to grab anything, everyone just holler at me. All right, all right, all right, sweet. sweet. Shocks, are you selling any um hair products at next in line or? Yeah, man, uh... gel. I got shocks the rebel gel, uh... I know. <laughs> Shock, shocks the red gel you or something. Stick on the hair things, the stick on the hair pieces. You need I've, to get I've got, I've got, I've got that VO. I got the VO five in it, spray the from the can. All that. The peel off ones. That's what oh, you need. Bro, I don't care about. Balding, isn't it? This is. I just shave my head. You can't care. You're not allowed to care. It's there. What are you gonna do? Cry? It's there. You can't care. My hair ain't even that bad. I could. I could grow over the patch, and I could. I could. I don't know if Simpson, you have hair. I've never seen your head. I don't know if you're bald. Or you don't have hair. You're hiding sign. No, I'm really not, bro. I'm just. I'm bald. That's it. I shave you my head. Hair. You're going back and forth, man. I'm, 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 that's anyway, why I'm, I'm so good at battle, isn't it? 3-0, no debating, 3-0. I don't care what no one thinks, 3-0. Three three oh. Oh. Right, yeah, right. like, I, I believe you. <laughs> right, my record's on my side, your record isn't. You lost a round last battle, you lost two rounds about before. I don't know who you battled before that. Uh, we'll see. All right. We'll All see right. you in October 8th. <laughs> yeah, October 8th. I mean, it's You're so- already practising your rounds in the mirror. I haven't I'm got chilling. any rounds written down, bro. What the I'm fuck? Chilling. I'm chilling. Legs up. Chilling. Chilling legs up. Yeah, I'm chilling. Get, legs bro, up. Get chilling leg- if you was chilling legs up, why do we have to wait 25 minutes for you to get on a fucking computer, bro? 
cars doing stuff. Jerry, I'm ready for eight. Twenty past eight. Yeah. Uh, oh, sorry. Oh. Sorry, Shocks. Jim will be ready in five, mate. <laughs> Twenty minutes oh, later. Yeah, I think he's on behind now. the scenes, Ting. Yeah, but I air that out. <laughs> Fuck it. Well, better, better, better. I do stuff before the interview than while I'm on the phone. Isn't it? Right. Yeah, I guess. <laughs> I guess. All right, all right, all right. Well, this has been uh, this has been awesome, guys. Thank you so much for joining me. Uh, no worries. Thank you, Tom. And, fuck, uh, shop. fuck Fuck you, Gemin one. <laughs> fuck Tom as well. He thinks you're gonna win. What? Fuck you, Tom. Innit? Oh shit. Gemin one, you know. <laughs> Alright, yeah. I'll, I'll be waiting for your Gemin one bar. No, bro. No, I had one Gemin one bar, which was a quadruple Crap. entendre, and I threw it away on Twitter. <laughs> oh, quadruple entendre. Yeah, it was. Yeah. It was. How what was, was the bar? What was the bar? I said. There's something about a graveyard. No, nah, yeah. Danny said. Shocks you versus Gem. I said get it done, but I host a battle in a graveyard plot because I'm about to drop Gem in one. Jeez. That's Come fire, on, bro. Man. That is fire. That is fire. That's not fire. <laughs> that is fire. <laughs> not fire. That is fire. I wish you kept that in your round. No, bro. That's if fire. The went off away. Again, I just I just agree that you're right. You're sick and I just don't I just don't see I just don't see the the, the, the magic. Man said Gem in one. That's that's fire. Yeah, you're right. right. It's a quad. How is that called or whatever? Oh, well, I've really got to break down the different meanings now. Well, I, I can only see two. My name and you're saying you're going to put me in a grave and you spelt my name. Isn't that one? Isn't that two? That's just two. I don't no. care. I'm going to Shocks. drop gem in. Right, host a battle. I'm going to drop gem in one. The battle. I'm going to drop gem in the battle. That's one. I'm going to drop gem in one. That's your name. I'm going to drop gem in one as in drop you in a graveyard plot. And also, I'm going to drop gems. In one, you understand. I'm gonna no, drop gems in a box. Fourth one's a reach. That's not a reach, bro. That's not a reach at all. That fourth one is a violent stretch. That's not a stretch. <laughs> oh fuck, you ain't a violent a stretch. Violent I'll reach. do a violent stretch. You carry on, boy. Oh, <laughs> that's how I'm I don't want you to do no violent stretches in it. Stay, stay where you are, bro. Don't lunge. Oh, uh, your man can come up in there talking about Luke Cage and fucking liking the feel of the fibers or whatever it is. The what? The, yeah. the material, the old feel. What's I got to do with anything? I'm baffed. You're baffed. I don't even know what I'm you're about, bro. You told I'm Tony bad. you were thorn in his side, bro. What, you a pest? He said, yeah. you said you're thorn in his side. Yeah, because he... Bro, because he was supposed to be the, the goat. And I was there to fuck him over. Born in my side. That's These hard, things man. actually make sense, bro. There's, there's, there's levels. Yeah, you said something about roses and you're a fawn in his side. I get it. It makes sense. You're a fawn in his side. I get it. Roses. Daffodil. Okay. Chill out. You're going to you're gonna turn Big T to a string vest, yeah? Yeah, that was fire. That was fire. Oh, my God, that was fire. Yeah, Man said, 100%. I'll make Swiss cheese out of his chest. Turn Big T to a string vest. Ah. Ah. You're going to make Swiss cheese out of his chest? Yeah. What does Swiss cheese look like? What gun have you got that you shoot? I don't 22 shoot stone black man and his chest killer. becomes cheap. <laughs> you are the killer. You are the killer. I am not a killer, bruv. You have the cans and the six. I do not proclaim to have cans and six. Well, let me tell you this. Not one gun that I've ever shot in my life Tiny. turns somebody to Tiny. cheese. Where is it? Man's got the Edam burner. <laughs> the Edam gun. I never said I have a gun. I don't even know. Your punchlines are whack. Punch you said you're going to turn his chest to Swiss cheese. Yeah. You what? Because it's got holes in it. Oh my God, bruv. What a reference. That was fire. No, it's the bar. What's after. next? I'm going to turn yeah. man's leg to a sponge. <laughs> that makes no sense. But that makes as much sense as I'm going to turn it to Swiss cheese. I never said I'll turn him to Swiss cheese. You're getting a bar wrong. All right, you turn his chest into Swiss cheese. Sorry, my bad. <laughs> no, you're getting a bar wrong, bro. We'll let you go with it. Go be fawning. Go be a fawn in someone's side, bro. Right now, you're a fawn in my side, bro. At least that actually makes sense, bro. I was trying to wind him up. You're a pest. <laughs> That's what you're saying. Annoying. Man said I'm a fraud on your side. I'm an annoying guy. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. Tom, you should wrap this up, bro, because it's gonna yeah. be a five hour yeah, show. Is... <laughs> yeah, yeah, I think I think this yeah. has been great, but uh <laughs> All right. Next in line, you know, uh, October eighth, so not long to go, about a month or so, about well, six weeks or so. But um Shop the butcher. Shop... <laughs> oh. <laughs> uh, Thank you everyone for listening. Subscribe, check out the Patreon, follow us at Bauer Resume, Shocks, Gem. Thank you guys again. It's been great. Respect on. Thank you. Fuck you, Jim. All right, all right. Fuck Uh, you.